Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, just a couple minutes ago, I made the Daiso Clay slime, the butter slime, with the Daiso Clay, and then here's the graphics from it. That's how I know. They know I just made it. And, um, this is how it turned out. Well, I think I showed you that already, but just in case something happened or you didn't get to see it for some reason, here you go. And it's so squishy. I love it so much. But I didn't show you the knife yesterday. No, not yesterday. Last video because like the kitchen was full. And um, as you could see, when I had to move frames. So I have my knife here already. And it's just like a butter knife, so it's not sharp at all. Yeah, not sharp. And now uh, we'll just try to spread it. Oh wait, you guys should see it before I see it. Well, see it at the same time. I haven't spread it at all. Wait, I need to turn the lights on. Now. Okay. Here we are. Wait, where's my little mark? Alright, here we are. This guy spreads perfectly. And if you have a butter slime and it's kind of hard, you want to add lotion to soften it. What you want to do is you want to add like maybe two pumps at a time and then mix it in and then test it. And how you know that it says, oh, it's still butter slime, is you can stick your finger in it and like it shouldn't, you should be able to mold it and it. May only shrink a little bit, but if you broke it, like the hole shouldn't be at all. That's how you know it's like a butter slime. But just saying, you shouldn't add that much lotion to the butter slime. Like in my mini slime smoothie, the slime that I told you that I added 50 or 70 pumps to of lotion, don't do that to butter slime. Unless you added like 50 things of clay. And it's super hard if you made like a tweeny slime and you added like 50 things of clay. Okay, then you can add like 50 new pumps of lotion. But I really doubt any of you did that. Um, well, anyways, yeah, that's how you just fix it. Literally, it's so soft. Now I know. Now, now I know, I'm oh, sorry, I'm just reading the side of the box right here. Here, you guys can read it if you want to. Now I know why so many people use this instead of, um, uh, what is it called? Oh, magic, because it works so much better. Like, I'm, to say so myself, I'm pretty good at making slime, but the Mono Magic Butter Slime, it never works out for me. You want to see my mo one of my Mono Magic Butter Slimes? Here we go. I'll get you one now. It, you you should see how bad it turned out. This is how all of them turn out. This is how a lot of them turn out on YouTube too. And the Daiso Clay. Ready? I'm going to show you. Daiso Clay. And then, Mono Magic Clay. Look at it, like, when you squish it, it doesn't really go back together at all. And ready, you wanna see it spread? Do you want to see it spread? Here we are. Like, oh my magic is totally better than Dice Out. No, it's really not. Look at all those little air bubbles. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna throw that away. Here is my magic. Here is Dice Out, I mean. It's 
so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time bye bye